Egyptian President Abdel Fattah el-Sisi has met with Libya's Khalifa Haftar, saluting Haftar's efforts to combat terrorism and extremist militias in his country. The meeting between the two, which is the second in about a month, comes during Haftar's Libyan National Army's offensive to take the Libyan capital Tripoli in a fight against the internationally recognized government headed by Prime Minister Fayez al-Sarraj. Here's CGTN's Adel al mahri with more. While the head of the UN-backed Libyan government, Faiza Sarraj, was looking for European support, his eastern rival, Khalifa Haftar, headed to Cairo for a three days visit. The only meeting announced during his stay was a debrief and discussions with President Abdel Fattah el-Sisi and the head of the Egyptian intelligence bureau, Abbas Kamel. Egypt has never stopped supporting General Khalifa Haftar, not only politically, but militarily as well. There have been previous airstrikes that Egypt launched to counter terrorist groups in Libya. This has been in coordination with the Eastern government. It is possible that Egypt and its regional allies who are fighting terrorism may engage in Libya. El Sisi has underscored his support to Haftar's campaign to eradicate all terrorist groups and militias. Cairo believes the Libyan Eastern Bloc is more capable of maintaining stability in Libya and security over its border. It's the second meeting in one month since Haftar launched his offensive against the Western government and Islamist militias supporting it in Tripoli. Khalifa Haftar is seeking more support from Cairo and Gulf allies Saudi Arabia and UAE. These regional powers have been heavily invested to counter militias, Islamist and terrorist groups. El Sisi is also trying to lift the UN arms embargo over Libya to give more military support to the LNA forces. Adel Mahroui, CGTN, Cairo.